What's good, youngins? I am back with another video. In today's video, um, it's somewhat ASMR, but it's not me soft speaking ASMR. So it's basically, you know, just me talking ASMR. So today's video is gonna be about that I get scammed. So this is a real thing because I don't know what's going on. I I'm pretty sure I didn't get scammed, but when when companies do stuff like this you kind of really don't know and they don't really give you you know um emails or anything about what's going on so you just kind of feel weird so like i was telling you guys my birthday was kind of my birthday i said kind of my birthday was last tuesday um january 8th me and my girlfriend batalas batalas asmr we went to los angeles batala bought me two pairs of shoes before we went um she thought they was going to be here by you know my birthday obviously working mistake you gotta you gotta you know you gotta order way before it's the holidays coming off the new year and stuff like that so you gotta order way before to get it where you trying to on a day that you're trying to get it so she ordered i'd say you know probably a week before my birthday again working mistake so she get the first shoe and the first shoe first shoe is the same thing when it comes to this is uh she bought me the the one that I showed y'all in my last video. Well, not my last video, but my other one I showed you guys, my sneakers, um, was the off-white Air Force Ones. It was the Volt colorway. She bought those for my birthday before, but they actually got here when we was actually in Los Angeles. So, no biggie with that. This shoe that she purchased was weird. And I get most of all my shoes that I'm buying recently has been from StockX. Before StockX blew up and got so big, I used to get all my sneakers from like uh, Flight Club and stuff like that, like trustworthy spots. So, and since StockX been blowing up, everybody been using StockX, and I've been using StockX. I, you know, it's some questionable sneakers that you know that I I, I thought were kind of like foo foo, but I got them, you know legit checked and people was basically saying like oh no you're fine like i got my travis scott's off stock x and i was kind of like eh. but one of my friends had got he won them off nike and i went to his house and we was just like looking and searching and looking at stuff he was like oh no these these straight everything had matched up so i had already been getting shoes from stock x and i already been thinking that certain things is kind of weird but this one gets a little weird so uh, she bought them and she told me like, oh, your sneakers gonna be here. This, we was in LA. She told me, she was like, your sneakers is gonna be here, but they're, they gotta get into the country. The country? <laughs> Anybody know who, who mess with sneakers? Um, the country um that's automatically thinking like some china foo foo crap but i don't want to talk to you guys ears up these are sneakers right here but i just want to give y'all the run up into like what's going on so into my asmr heads and stuff like that this is asmr but it's not you know um soft speaker asmr i looked up what asmr is is basically like you know just sounds and stuff like that so a lot of y'all to be like oh that's not asmr you should look up and figure out what ASMR actually mean before you actually say what what is ASMR was not ASMR it's just something you know with sounds and help you relax so this of me talking people can you know love me rambling and can go to sleep off that so yeah but basically let me stop getting off on a tangent here but yeah she was like your sneakers is gonna be here because I let her you know write the sneakers down on a piece of paper and she told me on my birthday what I had got before they was getting here because it was gonna take so long for them to get here so I'm like oh, okay she got me to vote them the ones I really wanted and then she said she got me this sneaker then she was tracking it so she was like oh no it's gonna be a parcel um, par parcel whatever it's called and I'm like ain't ain't stock X in Detroit I'm in Wisconsin Detroit is like to, you know our lake is uh lake michigan that's <laughs> you know michigan detroit like we're right there so i'm like normally when i was used to like early enough when i you know years ago when i was doing stock x my package used to be quick now everything is just coming late it's coming from this place it's coming from this place and i'm like before i thought everything was coming from detroit and that's the thing about stock x they don't they don't you know they don't 
communicate nothing until you have to ask them and you're like oh this is what happened so any more questions after that like you can you know you can let people know so yeah so we had the, uh she was like it's gonna be coming from overseas so i'm looking at it and right now i'm trying to put it in the video to show y'all what it says so i'm looking at it and i'm like um this don't this is kind of a little weird like i don't you know i look at sneaker reviews on on uh youtube so like nobody ever said nothing like this and i'm pretty sure if i'm looking at youtubers who's you know who's supposed to be giving us information they're supposed to be giving us information about stuff like that i'm like nobody ever said nothing like this so it's kind of weird for me so i, I didn't want to say nothing so i'm like okay let me let me just go about it so i emailed them and i'm like uh my package says coming from overseas aka that's where a lot of foo foo a lot of fake stuff coming from i'm like um it's coming from overseas i thought you guys was in detroit like like what was like what's going on and they emailed me back like oh we just opened up a new uh a, a new facility and what do you say hong kong whatever the place was i'm like oh Okay, I think he said, I don't know what he said. I, this probably should be on the shipping label, but he was like, oh, we opened up a new facility over there, overseas. So I'm like, okay, all right, that's cool. So, you know, I'm just not getting the shoes, so I, I haven't really looked at the shoes. Y'all gonna tell me if they real or they fake. Tell me if I got got. Let me know. Um, yeah, we. I, I, I want to, you know, bring it to you guys. And, you know, it's... The box is already ripped open because I, you know, I don't want y'all to see my address. But let's go ahead and open it up. And the shoe, the shoe, y'all see what that box is. Boom! It is Jordan Eight. Jordan Eight. OVO box that go to aisle the aisle right there and you know this is what the ace came in I also have the 12s and the 12s came in you know a box like this but one was all white and the other one's all black for the white and a black version so in this one the ace came in this so it's you know gray bottom white top I have never seen these you know in hand so I'm looking at these right with you guys so starting off the you know size eight because i wear eight and a half but eight's run big so right now jordan that jordan it don't have a jordan tag right there to show how much it costs so i don't i don't know normally all my shoes have jordan tags i don't know i remember you know looking at you know other shoe reviews and stuff and they say, you know, overseas, and if you get a shoe from overseas, sometimes it won't have the suggested retail tag, like the U.S. will be, because, like, it'll be, like, Jordan, it'll be, like, the U.S. Uh, retail, and it'll say the price of the shoe. So, I'm not saying that it's a flaw, but we're just going to go ahead and see it. And, like I said, these are from StockX, so uh, we both go on inside the the box it's a white you know got a little red boom right there look like just some numbers and stuff i don't see no 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 quality control sticker at all not in the front of the box right now we have stock x boom sticker they always send a sticker um boom right there right there boom they got that and right here is where it gets kind of weird so okay not hong kong i said hong kong i have no idea why i said hong kong but let me go ahead and just you know put my over the address but y'all can see y'all can tell right there if y'all can zoom in and see when the date was let's say 2019 you know uh, the look like 03 2019 and that's the new facility I guess 
and it says Stock X LLC London Hub Stanford Ellie Hope. Okay, my problem uh, before we get into this issue, my problem is if I live in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, and Detroit is right here. Why did my shoe come all the way from London? Uh, that's that's what. Can somebody explain that? I'm, in my head, I'm guessing because the seller is in London, so the seller can just ship it to London. But then London will have to. But then from London, they would have to ship it all the way to Wisconsin. That's that's where it get weird. Instead of you know the 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 one that's close to me is in Detroit, and won't that be easier to? I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, they say you know so y'all can see what I bought. Boom, Jordan Eight OVO. This is Drake shoe. This is his. This is Jordan Eight OVO White. You know. Authentic, new authentic, whatever the case may be from Stock X. Boom. Now let's go ahead and open these boys. Oh, 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 oh. we, oh, we. These are so fresh. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think these poo poo. <laughs> I don't know. These look. Fresh. Oh my god. I don't know. Y'all gonna have to tell me. Oh, these are fresh. Ah, hey, maybe I spoke too quick. These are fresh. I just seen some fake shoes in my life. And the oh my god, these are fresh. If these, if they fool, they 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 did a good job. But here it go the Jordan 8 and you know how the camera always blow it out and make it more white than it is no this shoe is that white so boom um it has the Jordan tag right there the red with the jump man right here and the back it has the OVO aisle from Drake the OVO aisle right there if it can boom right there um inside the tongue it says welcome it says welcome i don't understand what that what that's supposed to mean but yes it says it says welcome in gold um the inside of the the inside of the shoe have a white you know uh a white insole with a gold eye order am i saying the right aisle or owl owl i think it's owl what a white owl on there, so. Let me see the next shoe. Oh no. This is the next shoe. Let me see if it's, uh, okay, in a box, it doesn't have a quality control sticker, so. If anybody know this, can anybody tell me like what's what what's the process of shoes that's released overseas? Because there's a lot of stuff that a lot of people say that it's like oh overseas doesn't come with this, or the U.S. might have a U.S. sticker and overseas might have like a China sticker or something. So I'm I'm not familiar with buying a shoe but it released overseas so it might be different changes and different flaws to it so i'm you know i'm i'm rare i'm normally you know buy shoes with my knowledge that it released in the u.s so um there you go on this shoe it is the stock x you know hang tag right there the obo white eights these are beautiful oh my god these are beautiful these are so sexy bruh these are so sexy oh my gosh you know what i don't know i don't know if 
trust me, if if it come back and he start ex send me some poo poos, I don't know. I'm gonna have to do some YouTube reviews and stuff like that. But this shoe, the cra the weight of it, the craftsmanship, like the smell, like oh my everything just checks out, but I'm gonna do some more research. I'm gonna do like the style codes and stuff. Make sure everything is super legit. Cause, sorry, I'm not one of those guys. I'm not one of those guys. I don't talk it. I don't talk about people who who you know who wear you know fake things and do things like that. But when it comes to me, I would like don't scam me. You know what I mean? Like I'm not like don't scam. Like if if people want to spend any money on things that's that's overly priced and they like okay i want some gucci shoes but i'm not about to spend 700 dollars on it you know what i'm gonna get some knockoffs if that's how you want to go about it and like don't force me to to wear it you know what i mean don't don't take my money and force me to wear it so that's the only thing i really hate about scam i don't i, I really don't care less about what other people wear on their feet or when they clothes i'm not that type of person like oh my god look at that shirt that's all oh, that's a fake off oh, white shirt i'm not uh, i don't do that like no <laughs> I, I could care less what uh, somebody else got on if it's fresh it's fresh i most of the time a lot of people be wearing fake and you don't even notice but i'm not one of the people that's just gonna be staring at you and be like oh my god he wearing fake but my thing is just don't jip me because i don't I, I don't want to i'd rather you know spend the money if i want it to get it and if it's cost too much it's not for me i'm not one of them dudes just I'm just going to try to rock all the designer in this fake. It's just like, that's not me. I'd rather go buy stuff that's in my budget. If I don't have designer money, I'm not about to try to look like I have it. Like, if I have money to only buy Vans, I will only buy Vans. Like, um, I, I don't believe it to fake it till you make it my own. So, it's either you got it or you don't. Like, yeah, start, and don't try to be nobody else. So, that's, that's how I go about it. But, these are so fresh my guy <laughs> my guy these are so sexy and fresh at the same time i i, I want to just cut my fingers off because i don't even want my fingers to be touching them but these are so fresh thank you batala thank you for the birthday gift batala birthday is on january 27th so both of our birthdays in january so she already told me two things that she want but but batala's just irritated when it comes to gifts like she just uh <laughs> She's just so irritated, but yeah, thank you, thank you, boo, for these for a birthday gift. Um, yes, um, y'all let me know. I got these from Stock X, as y'all can tell. But yes, these are the Jordan OVO eights. Jordan OVO eights, bruh. We out here. But anyway, y'all like, comment, subscribe, follow me on all social medias. That's where you know, especially on Instagram. That's where I show. Most of everything that I got, as soon as I get it. So, you know, if I get a package in and I don't do an unboxing, I might show my Instagram first and, you know, DM me. If y'all want to hit me up or send me anything, I do respond and I do, you know, shout out people on my live. Not on my live, but my uh, on my Instagram story. I post, I tag people and stuff like that. So, if y'all want to interact with me, y'all can. J Young 8, Life is Young. And Instagram, you should see it down here. But... OVO Ace is my new pickup. Y'all like, comment, subscribe. I'm out. New videos in the way. Follow me and Batala at our couple channel. The link should be in the description. We just posted a dirty truth or dare in our couple channel. Go watch that. Go subscribe to us on that. Um, this is Life is Young. More videos on the way. Um, I have, this is a surprise, but more videos on the way. More ASMR videos on the way. More just Life is Young on the way. Y'all subscribe and support me. I really think uh, let's get to that 30K. Let's get to 30K. Once we hit 30K, I got another giveaway. So like, comment, and share, and let's get it. I'm gone. Peace. Peace, peace, peace.